Rings. It's a symbol of forever. A symbol of your commitment till death do you part. How much are you willing to spend on it? I'm willing to spend $5,000 on a ring. A guy walked into the store and he wanted like the most expensive ring. If I have to spend a lot on it, then it's more like an investment. Diamond rings are precious stones. I'll say diamond rings. I think diamonds are a bit over -hyped. Diamonds are forever. If you don't have a ring, how are we going to get married? This is Wedding on a Budget. Hi, my name is Sarah Ademola. I am a customer sales rep from Boss Jewelry. How important are rings to wedding ceremonies? I think they're really important. It's become a symbol of um, um, a commitment to between couples. Um, rings are very important because it's, it signifies sign of commitment to the spouse, so they are really, really important. Wedding rings are like the show of the old thing, so they are very important when it comes to the wedding. Like. There is no wedding, there is no wedding ring. So they are very important. Does the popularity of the brand matter? Not really, it doesn't really matter. What matters to me is the quality of the ring and how beautiful it is really. There are a whole lot, there are a whole lot. We have oval, we have round, we have cushion, we have the princess cut, we have the marquis cut, we have the baguette cut, we have the radiant cut, we have the hot cut, so there are a whole lot out there. Do I know my ring size? Well, I used to know it, so I knew it at the time I was going to buy it, so I went and tested it. But honestly, it's not stuck in my mind. No, it's not. Um, I know my ring size because I'm a proposal planner, so I use my size to determine what grooms will buy. So I say, okay, I'm a 6.5. Is your, is your fiance's ring bigger or smaller than mine? And they say, oh, I think it's a bit bigger. I said, we'll have to fit this, but she might be a 7 or a 7.5 or a 5.5 based on that. How can a groom get the size without her finding out? Um, okay, so we get this a lot where the groom will come in and be like, oh, I don't know the ring size, but it's a surprise, so how do I go about it? So some of them will bring like a picture of her fingers and they expect us to like guess a size. So be like, oh, we can guess a size, we can only try, but we can give an accurate size. But another thing we advise, let's say in a situation whereby they get the opportunity to spend a night together. So you can, as a groom, you can get a, a paper and then you put it round the ring finger, not too tight, not too free, a perfect size. Then you mark where both end stops then you get the paper and you put it on a ruler using the centimeter side. You put it on a ruler and that way you get the size. You just need to come to us and then we will convert what you got in centimeter to a ring size. How much will I be willing to spend on a ring? It depends on the budget. -o. It depends on the budget. -o. I should not go in my transport fare to buy a ring. But definitely, I think um, good things actually cost money, so I don't mind. I'm going to spend uh, some good money on looking good. Like a thousand or two dollars. About 500,000 and above. Max, 500,000 now. How much money should you put aside for your couple set? Um, so for diamonds, it depends. They, we have different clarities of diamonds and all that, so the price varies. But if I want to start from like the lowest, just for people that have like, let's say, a lower budget, um, for a couple trio set, um, the male band is around, um, 1 million and the female set is around 1.5 and this um, considering the gold carats let's say you're getting a 10 carats gold couple set with few diamonds on it yeah so you should be looking at 2.5 fish for a budget if you're considering what um, what clarity you're going for because we have the IF which is like um, the highest diamond clarity the flawless one then we have the VVS. Um, for VVS, yes, you should be looking at 2.5 for VVS. And then we have the VS. Obviously, the VS is less expensive compared to the VVS. Then we have the SI, and then we have the I. So the I is like the lowest, lowest. So for I, for a couple set, you should get from um, 1.5. 1.5 for a 10 cards gold ring with I diamond clarity. 
Ring prices are relative. Rings are tailored to suit your budget. If you want it and can afford it, what's stopping you? Get it and wear that rock proudly. Oh, my God.